Hello everybody and welcome back to Jazzy61. So today's video is actually a bonus video, yay! I mentioned to you guys I'm trying to get back to my old format of two videos a week. So we're going to give it a shot this week and see how it goes. But today I want to say hello and welcome if you are new here. Hi, my name is Jazz. I do everything motherhood, lifestyle, a little bit of beauty. And I would absolutely love it if you joined the family by subscribing today. I post on Mondays at 4.30 p.m. Central Standard Time and I would love it if you came back by to see me again. And welcome back to my returning family and new subscribers. Subscribers. Hi guys, welcome back. I do hope that you enjoyed today's video as well. As I mentioned, it's a bonus video. I am excited to share this product with you guys because it is something that my family really needs a lot. The whole lot. So let's go ahead and uh, get into what we're working with. So to explain this box, I kind of got to explain what's been happening around our home. So we moved to this house about a year ago. And as soon as we got here, you guys, there has been a slew of issues with our baby boy, our four-year-old. And he has been sneezing and snotting and coughing and everything else nonstop since we got here. And we found out that he has a dust allergy. He has a grass allergy. Like any and everything that could hit my baby sideways, hit my baby sideways, okay? And we didn't know any of this until we got here. And so once we got here, my husband, his allergy started to act up. My husband got a dust allergy, y'all. Now I think that's funny because he an African. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of dust over there. And I've been to his hometown. It's dusty. Sometimes. It... And then I realized I have allergies too. I've never had allergies before, you guys. Never in my life have I had allergies. Now, this is an issue around here because, like I said, we're in the middle of nowhere, Texas. It's dust everywhere. And we are surrounded by open plains and open fields with cows and horses and everything. So the smells, it's crazy. It's crazy in my house, okay? And in addition to all of that, we have a dog. So there's pet dander. And there's also like pollen and things like that because the seasons were changing. And so we have been just having a hard time breathing in general in my house. So we have a lot of tiny air purifiers <laughs> everywhere. They're, my, they're like moanly. Yeah, they are mainly in our bedrooms, but the main part of our house is like just kind of bare. So you kind of got to deal with it during the day and hope for the best. And at night we would go to sleep and I would start to cough and to sneeze and things like that in my sleep from dust just kind of kicking up by the ceiling fan or something like that. And so that's why we put them in our rooms so that when we're in our bedrooms, then maybe our air will be a little bit better. And it did work for a little while. The issue that I have been finding is that every few days or so, the machines are full of dust again. Like not just the inside, the outsides too. And that's why I was saying it's so dusty here. And I didn't realize how much dust was here. And so since we didn't know any of this, we kind of were coming into it blind, trying to figure out what we can do and what could help. And like I said, those purifiers helped for a little while at night. They still do okay um, because we haven't had a lot of sneezing and wheezing and coughing, you guys, because we go through so much tissue. Y'all wonder my hall why I be having all them clinics that's why and so i am trying to find something that's going to do a great job for the entire house so we don't have to have a whole bunch of tiny little machines everywhere and that is where this bad boy comes in so this is the air dog green technologies air purifier did i say that right Yes, I did. Air purifier, you guys. Now, this thing covers over 4,000 square feet. Now, I ain't gonna hold y'all off because I just thought to myself, get the biggest one. It's bigger than my house. Um, <laughs> it's about 1,000 square feet more than my house. And that's okay because we want to have our, listen, if you smoke around the house like this, Okay, I'm breathing good, okay? We're gonna be breathing good, you hear me? So I'm gonna go ahead and open this thing with you guys on camera so we can see all the parts, all the pieces, all its features. I will be popping on to talk to you guys about some of its features because I am excited about some of these eco-friendly features of this product. I'm gonna put it together. We're gonna stand this bad boy up, turn it on. We're gonna listen to it and all that good jazz. If you end up interested in this product, I'm gonna link it in the description box below. They do have smaller ones, which I probably should've got the next size down, but you know what? We have been make a shake, okay? Um, So I'll go ahead and put this thing together with you guys. And then I'm gonna come back on here at the end, give me some of my thoughts, and then we're gonna close out this video. 
So first off, I was struggling to lay this box down, but I always struggle with packages, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and get this thing cut open. You guys, the box that it comes in is much bigger than the actual air purifier itself. They package this thing so well, you guys. You're going to see once I open this box up how much styrofoam is actually in here. And it's just kind of making sure that this thing isn't shifting around in there, that nothing gets damaged. It is packaged nicely. So I'm going to slide this thing out of this box really easy it just kind of pops out that's the filter and then the next big section there is the purifier itself you guys it's not that crazy heavy the only reason why i didn't want to lift it is because like i said before i did a little damage to my back when i had our newest addition to the family and so i tried to do a lot of things on my own but it actually came out pretty easy as well i slipped this cover off of it and it was pretty much ready to go all i need to do was add the filter so you guys, as I previously mentioned, one of the things that I like about the X8 and the AirDog air purifier systems in general is how eco-friendly it is. And one of the reasons that I say it's eco-friendly is because of the filter. So this is the filter right here. I'm gonna take it apart, show you guys the filter. Not take it apart, I'm gonna open it up right now. So you guys get a good look at it. And then I'm going to explain a little bit more as to why I think it's so cool. So, this is the filter, right? Now, this filter comes apart. This is the top of it here. This filter comes apart. These little grids in here. You can rinse them off, let them air dry for about 20 minutes or so, pop them right back together and it's good to go. You're not buying filters. You're not out here um, trying trying to rinse off the one that's like kind of a fabric-y material and the dust is kind of getting embedded in it. It's none of that. It's a simple rinse it off, let it air dry because it's like plastic. It's solid plastic. And um, once you rinse it off and it dries, put it back together and it's ready for use again. So that is something that really intrigued me by this one as well because the ones that I have currently are the ones that have like the the mesh kind of material. So even if you dust it off, some of the dust is still stuck in there and you can rinse it off in the sink some, but what happens is that dust kind of rinses into the thing and you can't put it in the washing machine. So over a certain amount of time, you're gonna have to replace it anyway. And it's kind of the same with a lot of air purifiers. You just have to keep replacing filters. So this is a very eco-friendly air purifier where you don't have to do all of that, which is why I thought, even though for the price, it's worth it. I don't have to go back to the store and buy more filters. And all of their purifiers are this way. So let's go ahead and rotate this bad boy around and put the filter in so I can show you guys exactly how easy it is to slide this filter into this machine and get this bad boy going. So here I am just pulling the back panel off. This is another one of the little wire racks that goes in there. I was trying to show you guys the wires there. It slides in at the bottom right underneath where the filter goes in. And then this is the filter. It shows you which side is up. You slide that in right on top of it. It pops into place. And then you can just pop that panel back on and this thing is ready to go. Let's go ahead and plug it in together. <laughs> Alright. Did touch anything? I don't know if you guys can see the numbers across the screen over here. I'll get closer to it so that you can. But this thing is neat. Y'all is on. Do you hear it? It's so quiet. <laughs> I love that. I absolutely love how quiet. Do you guys hear that quiet? That is it. That's it. I love that. <laughs> So here I caught myself trying to do the Vanna White and kind of show y'all the displays up here. I did not do a good job, but I'm gonna go into further detail after this clip. I was just showing you that there was Wi-Fi connectivity there and that there's a child safety lock and that there is a way to turn up the fan in there and where the power button is and the nighttime button. You guys, I just, I, I didn't realize the camera had such a glare on there so you couldn't really see it. Alrighty, you guys, so I have it just running right now and I did turn the fan speed up on it and it is still so quiet. I love that. 
So what I was trying to show you guys here at the top, don't know if I did a good job of it, is basically this screen shows you everything that you need to know. So there is Wi-Fi connectivity to this thing. There is a child safety lock. You know, I got kids and they probably gonna be in here like, Ooh, what is that? So I need to make sure I can put that on. This part in the middle controls the wind speed. And when you turn it on, it goes to the automatic mode. It goes up about, you can do it by eight clicks, I believe, on that button. And each time you push it, it goes up another notch. So right now I have it on 500. It was on 300 when I turned it on a minute ago for you guys and it was really quiet. 800 is the max on here. Y'all see I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, there is also a nighttime mode on this side and then you have the power button which is also kind of the uh, indicator button to change the speeds and things like that on the top. And then if you look here on the front, you see that, yeah, that green bar there? That green bar is the air quality. It'll tell you based upon the color. So the green means excellent, yellow green means good, yellow means moderately polluted, and red is hazardous. So it tell you when you got some hazardous stuff going on. Come on, hazardous. Um, <laughs> but so far, I think this is absolutely amazing. And even though I turned it up, it's still very quiet. The other ones that I have in my home, this one is about five times the size, five or six times the size of the ones that I already have. And this is quieter than them. And that's amazing to me that it's so quiet. I love that. One thing I was concerned about was it being loud. You know, you don't want something in your living room that's and you yelling over it to hear your family and things like that. But this is so quiet. It's like a very low fan. I don't know if you guys can hear it. It's so nice. It's peaceful. I need that peace, y'all. Okay. I'm planning on putting this in the main area of my home, you guys, where you can see from the front door to the back door. That's where I want to put this at because we don't have anything in there. And the little ones wouldn't even get close to covering it. We would have to have like three, four of them in there just to cover that space. So I'm going to put this one in our main living room. And hopefully when I open the doors, it'll do just the same kind of wafting into the rooms. <laughs> wafting. It'll kind of reach off into the rooms and also kind of purify the air there as well. Because I'm going to put it on the end closest to our bedrooms as well. But you guys, this thing is great. I'm thinking I'm gonna get one from my mother as well. My mother and my stepfather's a bit older and he has health issues. So it's important that he has a very good space with air quality that's really good. I want my mama to have good air too. You know, I want her to be able to breathe and everything be straight. I think I'm gonna get them one of these because I think this is gonna be a great addition to their house. My mom's house is very big. <laughs> so I think this is gonna be a great addition to their house. And so I think this is something that I would purchase for them as well as a gift. Because if you have older family members, you have people that have breathing issues. For instance, my sister and my niece have asthma. This is something that they need as well. And so I find things like this and if they work the way that I hope they work, and these are going to be good gifts for people as well especially people in my family people that i love who i want to have you know the best quality of health and um, quality of life as well so i think this is going to be awesome and i am so excited for it <laughs> i'm going to get my husband to move it because i don't think i could do it by myself i think i could try i don't want her my back um <laughs> as you guys know i did hurt my back a while back so I think I'm going to have my husband move this into our living room. I'm going to get it set up out there and turn it on. So here I wanted to give you guys an overview of the machine. I love its sleek design. I love it. It kind of blends in with the decor in my home. I love how quiet it is, but this thing looks awesome. I am so excited for this thing. I think that it is awesome so far and hopefully if it gets better i'm gonna let you guys know in the comment section down below as well you probably see this in future videos too so if you have any questions about it any updates that you may want please let me know in the comment section down below and i will make sure to give you guys an update on this machine because i am so excited for it i think it looks really sleek so it's going to blend in with my decor and it's not going to stand out too crazy um and it's not crazy bulky either so i think it's going to blend in just fine 
Okay, you guys, so this is actually where it ended up landing. It's right here next to our fireplace, you guys. So much dust comes down that fireplace. It's crazy. Please excuse the cord hanging down there. We're going to get our TV mounted. We just hadn't done it yet. But so much dust comes down the fireplace that I had it covered. And I didn't want to leave it covered because it looked really weird sitting over there with a box in front of it. So I took it down, but the dust comes down right there. And this is a space right between the two bedrooms that we sleep in. And so I wanted to put it there so that it could possibly reach into those rooms especially at night i think i'm going to turn it up and just let that kind of get into our bedroom and that door there is our toddler's bedroom and he is the one that's been struggling the most so this is where i landed y'all why i struggle to take this thing in the living room i struggled for a good solid five minutes only to find out it had wheels y'all who i be tripping Okay, you guys, so that is all I have for you today. I truly hope you enjoyed today's video. Please let me know what you think in the comments section down below. Or if you have any more questions, I will make sure to answer those in the comments as well. As I mentioned before, there will be a link to this product in my description box. And if you are interested in it or a smaller version of it, you can find it. Thank you guys again so much for watching this video. Like I said, I'm pretty, I'm pretty, pretty 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 i appreciate you guys so much for watching it for staying tuned for being so supportive of me and this channel you guys are the absolute greatest if you haven't already please like comment share and subscribe and i would truly love to have you thank you again to my returning and new subscribers <laughs> thank you guys i really do appreciate you so so very much so thank you and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye guys